So yeah guys, today I'm going to install the Bomar grip tape on my RX-5 and uh, I know Josh did a video um, how to do it but um, I'm obviously shooting the Garmin, Garmin Zero Sight and uh, the ranging button is on your grip so let's see how we can figure it out to, to make it work so uh, stay tuned, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video a um, little bit of a difficulty self filming but uh, let's see what happens so uh, yeah thanks for watching and uh, let's see how we can install this very nice piece of equipment um, so yeah bear with me so here you can see at the back of the package um, there's clear instructions on how to do it um, I will link Josh's video to apply it um, to your bow as well in the description below but um, this video is basically just to, to figure out how we can install this so that you know your your ranging button on the Garmin Zero site still works so uh, yeah let's open that up um, they've put in a, like a quick like an easy easy to use like easy to open um, cut away the eight day so uh, yeah easy as that just open it up and then um, we can take it out so guys this little button here is the purpose of this video um, we will just have to figure out what will be the best way to uh, to install the Bomar grip tape um, so that you can still you know have easy easy access to that ranging button which is so important on that Garmin site so uh, yeah I'm gonna play around with a couple of ideas and see what we came up or what we can come up with so um, yeah let's see what happens but uh, super excited to try this out um, this green is also gonna look really really nice on, on the wilderness riser of my weight so uh, let's see I'm super excited to try this out so obviously step number one is just to remove this kind of protective layer. Um, I'm not going to overly remove it just uh, just for you know ease of ease of use later on. This is also the um, the sticky the sticky parts protection. So uh, we can get this loose and then uh, we can we can try to apply it. Um, but yeah, um, really really easy to use. Um, feels amazing well done Josh um, so yeah let's see what we can come up with so uh, yeah I think we uh, we found a way to, to work around this um, what I'm gonna do is, is as, as Josh suggests in his uh, video um, I'm gonna start with this thin part here and uh, going around there wrap it tightly there and then come over like here what I'm gonna do is, is I think is I'm gonna cut as I as we go I'm gonna cut out a piece there wrap it around and then it'll obviously be a little bit lower so then cut out the the top piece so that that button stays outside of the grip tape um, so the first step will be to remove this protective sleeve as well as the part that kind of hides the the sticky sticky side so uh, yeah let's get cracking and uh, don't do it as quickly as I just did um, Josh in his video said just remove it slowly I didn't um, so now we just need to get that little piece again Got it. So uh, yeah, just gonna remove this slowly, as the man himself said in the video. Um, I'm just gonna go try and figure out how much I'll be needing. I don't think much further than that. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna cut this this piece there. Um, 
So obviously in the packet, um, in the package there's enough tape to really, really get at least two bows out. So um, yeah, that's pretty cool. So now that we have removed the like the protective sl sleeve, um, I'm going to put this in here. I'm just going to turn my bow a little bit. I want to make sure you guys can see. And then. Obviously be very careful, you don't want to cut that garment wire. I don't think the warranty is going to help you there. Same thing here at the bottom. This one we can go a little bit deeper. guys can see that's kind of what what I came up with um, I'll clean up that part there in a, in a short bit um, but um, yeah I think it will will definitely work so uh, now just to finish the grip So I think that's as far as my grip will go. I don't really have a very like flat grip, so I'm normally in there. So I'm um, just gonna cut this nicely. Just like this. Wow, it feels really, really solid. Um, so yeah, um, there we go. I'm gonna finish it off in a moment so uh, yeah I think uh, I think we're there I hope this thing's all to focus it's doing its part um, looks like it but uh, but yeah really really feels awesome um, I think it's, it's definitely gonna improve sweaty hand shooting when when hunting so uh, yeah I'm just gonna quickly end of um, the process um, it has like that finish finishing tape you put on and then um, just want to show you guys I still have like like good amount of grip tape left or 100% do another bow um, so uh, yeah that's kind of very very cool so uh, I'm gonna put this in here um, so that it doesn't get like dust and stuff on it but um but yeah i think uh i think we we good eh um uh sorry trying to figure out how to film this the best first video with a new camera so let me know what you guys think of the quality but um but yeah i'm gonna finish it off in a second and then uh, i'm gonna shoot a couple of arrows um, so i really hope this helps all those Garmin, Garmin users to figure out what they can do with the Bowmark grip tape. So guys, I'm gonna finish off my grip with this last piece. Um, this is just to ensure that it that it stays there. Um, and obviously a little bit of the logo um, on it. So um, yeah, let's, let's do that.
that's it guys um, I think it it came out pretty nice um, I'm happy with how it feels um, just the feel of this thing is amazing um, I quickly neaten up this uh, this part here so uh, I made this look a little bit better I think you can even go like further and cut it out there but as far as the button goes you know I think we we did a fairly okay job um, I'm gonna shoot it a couple of arrows see how it feels but just the feel of it is you know it's pretty amazing so uh, yeah um, this bottom layer sticker is up I don't know what they call it but um yeah I think we we got to to roll um, so uh, yeah this is it guys um, Bowmore archery grip tape is installed on a bow with a Garmin zero sight I obviously love this sight it has served me incredibly well over the last few years so there was no way that I'm gonna take it off um, this year so uh, I just need I knew I had to figure out a way just to install this this uh, grip tape but it feels really 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 well button is still there so I'm gonna shoot a couple of arrows see what it does um, super excited we are actually heading to Tanzania next week with Josh and Sarah Bomar second hand with African bow hunting adventures for them and I'm taking my bow with as a backup for Josh um, so yeah fingers crossed on an amazing trip and uh, yeah well done to the Bomars for this grip um, first ever in the archery industry so uh, yeah super proud of you guys you are amazing people and um, looking forward to our hunt so I'm gonna shoot a couple of arrows thank you for watching um, I'm gonna work on <laughs> my presentation skills but uh yeah if you have any like comments or thoughts please put it in the comment section um we're gonna try to be better every single time so my first video with a new camera still learning how to use it um hoping that the bomars camera guys jeff and bryce will, will be able to teach me a, a couple of stuff while we're over there in tanzania so i hope you guys enjoy the video thank you for watching so yeah guys, I'm quickly going to shoot a couple of arrows, um, just trying to figure out the best zoom for this. Um, so yeah, I'm just curious to feel how it feels on the shot, um, it really is a nice texture, so uh, obviously you will only kind of know the importance of it when you're in a stressful situation and your hands are sweating or your bow is soaking wet or ice cold, so uh, yeah, let's see what it does. Good news, my Garmin's reticle is still like 100% in, so uh, that just shows that there's no extra like hand torque or something like that, um, which is cool to know. Um, just gonna shoot another one. looks really really good so um, that's it guys this thing works um, I will give you guys feedback on how it shoots in the like in the bush out while we're hunting so um, I'm just happy we could have solved the the problem I had with it you know just this button is very very important um, on the garment so uh, yeah I think uh, this will last um, I've got a couple of a couple of them available in South Africa as we speak so uh, Send me a DM on Instagram. Maybe there's still one left when you text me. But um, thank you for watching once again. See you guys soon.